Hi, I'm Catherine of GamerCast.net and um, I thought I'd just do a quick video to show off something that I recently bought. Uh, well, I bought it the second it was announced and it came today. So, um, the Visceral store, who are of course a, a part of EA, um, who made Dead Space, Making Dead Space 2 and made Dante's Inferno, uh, have been putting some cool stuff up on their store. One of which, which is the Agaeus 7 lithograph. Which is this. I'll show a little bit more in a sec. So just a, just a bit about it. Um, it's 18 by 24 inches, I believe. I don't know inches, um, but I'm guessing that's what the size of it is because it doesn't really say if it's inches or centimeters on the website. But I'm I'm guessing maybe unless that is centimeters. Actually, that's centimeters, isn't it? No. I don't know. Anyway. Who knows? Um, so it's on a uh, hundred pound paper. So if if you notice, it's really thick. Okay, um, which of course is good because it means it's printed on nice quality paper. So the print's as good as it could get. Um, it's limited to five hundred. Uh, it's by Ryan Church, who is the well. He did a lot of the concept art for Dead Space, and he did well. He does concept art in general, so he did it for Episode Two. As in Star Wars Episode 3, Transformers 1 and 2, War of the Worlds, things like that. Um, he's working on a new Disney film with Andrew Stanton, I think. Uh, the Wally and Finding Nemo guy. Anyway, so uh, yeah, so as you can see here, Ryan Church's uh, signature. And they're all hand numbered. Uh, so I've got 87, which is cool because it was the year I was born, so it's kind of. A nice number for me. Um, I have a mate at work who bought one as well, um, and he got 19. No, he did 99 or 97. So was kind of, if it was 99, it was a cool number. Um, but yeah, so that's that's all the info on it. So uh, you want to have a look? It's got the Dead Space logo at the bottom. Copyright EA. And it says a gay seven. No, that's the. Uh, picture it's kind of hard to show because it's quite large if I uh, keep finding it hard to uh, realize how big it is so there's a game Let's move quite far back to be able to show how big it is hopefully you get some kind of a uh, some kind of no. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, a nice print. I'd love to frame it and uh, put it up on a wall, but unfortunately, I'm not allowed to put things up on my walls. Um, and I'd probably be moaned out as well. So yeah, damn tenancy agreements. Uh, not much I can do about that. Um, I'm, I will look after it along with everything else I have, and. Uh, I recommend you get it. Oh yeah, it's uh, twenty nine ninety five. That dollars though, on the Visceral store website. Um, I think international shipping was thirteen dollars. It's way cheaper if you live in America, of course. Um, so it didn't work out being very expensive. They've done another one, which is the medical, medical bay, medical center bay. Um, but they're unfortunately sold out. But they were the same price as well. And they've got Dante's Inferno ones up as well. Um, but I just thought I had to have it. They've got lots of cool stuff actually on the, the Visceral store of uh, other Dead Space related items. You can get a cool bag that's like his health bar. Um, there's t shirts, loads of Dante's Inferno stuff, just loads of stuff really. Um, but I quite like art, prints, and anything concept y, like most people do. Um, so I had to get it. So, uh, yeah, it's cool. You should pick one up. They've still got them left. You can still, oh shit, you can still buy them on the website. Uh, so, you know, twenty nine ninety five is not too bad for a nice big print. If you like space or dead space or EA or visceral or Ryan Church, any of those. Um, and yeah, and then when they sell out, you got to collect the item because there's only five hundred of them done. So that's cool. Um, yeah, so. I'm Catherine of uh, Gamecast.net and uh, don't forget to check out the website www.gamecast.net 
or check out any of our other videos on the YouTube channel as well. And uh, I'll catch you later with the uh, Demon Souls Phantom Edition unboxing because that comes out this Friday in the UK. Um, so I'd probably be getting that either tomorrow or the day after, and then I'll do an unboxing of that as well. Um, yeah, and then after that, StarCraft 2. I think that's the next one. Uh, but yeah, uh, see you later. Bye bye.